the passion that he had for Augusta National and the Masters Tournament. We remember the shots that, that Seve played here at Augusta. He's just an incredible legend. I guess it was meant for him to be the champion. He'll go down as one of the greatest European golfers of all time. So much legacy and so much history. Seve being the first European to win the Masters. I think he broke a lot of barriers. He opened a lot of doors for the coming generations. And the best thing to win the Masters, you, you will be here forever. And I'm very happy. It was the way he played the game, the way he reached to people on the golf course. I think people were eager to see him play because they knew they were going to see something special. Seve was a genius. He was a magician. He was a swashbuckler. The most thing I admired about Seve's game was his imagination and his willingness to create shots, to curve the ball one way or the other, to be a fighter, to be a competitor to the end. What he's able to do with the ball is amazing. And you can learn a lot from him and just being, you know, trusting yourself to kind of go after whatever and do whatever, and he was huge for European golf. He was very flamboyant, <laughs> I have to say. <laughs> I think, you know, he had a, a, an aura around him. The way he, he played, he always played extremely aggressive golf. He, he went for, you know, all the flags. But what a courageous shot. Uh, he flirted with danger, but came out fortunate. Seve was a global star for sure. Such charisma. And it's not folklore, but it, but it kind of felt like that. This guy from Spain with a short game no one's ever seen the likes of before. He was a legend <laughs> in every sense. He took his game into the world and showed that there's good European players. He did amazing things for golf worldwide. After he won in 1980, how many Europeans came and started winning, right? He was the one that paved the ground. I mean, if it wasn't for a man like him, I wouldn't have had the path I had in Spain to get here. He made us believe that we were capable of coming here and play against the best. Few players that are blessed with not only the skill but the charisma that draw you into them, and Seve was one of those. Oh boy. The joy and the, and the relief and the compassion that he had to compete at such a high level in this game. Many times on our Tuesday night past champions dinner, we, we honor him. We don't forget the great Seve Ballesteros. His legacy is extraordinary. He should be well up there with the very best golfers of history. And isn't this just the most unbelievable count? For me, he will always be number one.